Well, Brian, the U.S. Attorney's Office uh, telling us this afternoon that Donald Fell is expected back in Rutland next week for a new hearing in federal court. It could be his last time in the state. It's a change of plea hearing in connection with the November 20, uh, 2000 kidnapping and murder of Terry King. Now, if Judge Jeffrey Crawford accepts Fell's guilty plea, we assume in exchange for a life sentence, the case will end. There will be no second trial. Writing on Facebook, King's daughter, Karen King Worcester, said justice won't be served if that happens. The family still wants Fell executed. The only good thing that comes out of this, she wrote, is I won't continue to see his face pop up on my Facebook news feed or tune, turn on the 6 o'clock news and have to see him any longer. Worcester calls this 18-year-old wait for justice a very emotional roller coaster for the family. Police said Mrs. King was kidnapped by Fell and by an accomplice as uh, King arrived for work at the Rutland Price Chopper back in November of 2000. She was killed over the border in New York State. The accomplice uh, ended his life in prison while awaiting trial. Fell was convicted by a Vermont jury but won a new trial thanks to juror misconduct. Now his change of plea scheduled next Friday, September 28th, 10 a.m. at the federal courthouse in Rutland, perhaps a half a mile from the spot where Terry King was abducted. From the live desk, Stuart Ledbetter, NBC5 News.